Welcome to Bite Size UGC. I'm Captain P.F. Dennis, and this is Rogue Enterprise. This week, we take a bite out of Star Trek Online's Foundry with a review of the prudential use of violence by X. Dev Null. Okay, let's jump right in with our first category on the list, Story. The mission opens with Starfleet sending you to a planet in the Regulus Sector where a group of creepy cult-like Ferengi have taken over a dilithium mine and are holding hostages. After you beam down, you discover that none other than Franklin Drake and a much older version of Drake are somehow involved. Apart from being able to recognize the older man as Drake as soon as you lay eyes on him, the story is interesting but you never get much of an explanation before the mission ends and you realize that this will be a multiple episode story arc. For this, we gave story four stars out of five. Next up is map design. The author spent considerable time on the surface map of this mining settlement. It looks great, as does the cave map used for the actual mine. The only issues were the fact that there were a few instances where you had to traverse great distances to reach a contact, disrupting the mission pacing. There was also a lot of rock climbing involved inside the cave map that may be difficult for less experienced players and a couple of single action maps that only had one objective that we felt could be fleshed out to include more detail or activity. For maps, three stars out of five. Moving on to difficulty. There was both space and ground combat in this mission, starting on the planet with the optional Targ hunt. Progressing into the caves, both of us were incapacitated once in normal mode by two mobs that were too close together to be fought separately. The respawn was also placed in an inconvenient spot, requiring more rock climbing. Space combat was fine, and there was plenty of it up until the mission's conclusion. All in all, we'd have to say that the combat, although necessary to move the mission's main theme, was a little unbalanced, so we gave difficulty 3 stars out of 5. Our final category is tech. How did the author use the game mechanics? He used mirror feds reskinned as Ferengi as the ground mobs. There were no puzzles, advanced dialogue trees, or advanced mechanics employed. Apart from a few explosions and vanishing objects, the mission had a solid, straightforward, and bug-free feel from beginning to end. We gave Tech 3.5 stars out of 5. And that's our review of the Prudential Use of Violence by X Dev Null. Go and rate it yourselves. Port STO's Foundry by playing these missions. Until next week, this has been Bite Size EGC. 